Good morning, Warriors, and welcome to Wild TV. My name is Ty. And my name is Gabby, and today is Tuesday, April 12th. Next Tuesday, April 19th, all juniors will be taking the ACT. Most juniors will be in the same testing locations as the SAT a few weeks ago. However, a few students will have been moved around. Be sure to double check for your right testing location. SGA is holding a class officer election as well as a voter registration drive in the gym lobby today from 7 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. 9th, 10th, and 11th graders will be allowed to vote as long as they bring a photo ID. 12th graders are highly encouraged to come and register to vote. Lake Whitney Elementary School is having their spring carnival on Friday, April 22nd, and are looking for high school volunteers. The hours are from 4 p.m. to 8.30 p.m., and dinner will be provided before the event. Seniors, if you have not ordered your cap and gown, orders can be placed at joshins.com or in person at cap and gown distribution slash senior clearance, May 6th, cash only. Don't forget to purchase your yearbooks. There are only 60 left for sale. You can purchase on yearbookforever.com or school pay for $80. If there are any left over, they will be sold for $100 starting May 1st. Books will be passed out the second week of May. The Honduran Shoe Drive has officially ended on April 1st, but there is a large deficit in youth sizes. If you have any infant, toddler, or children's shoes, please consider donating before we ship in May. For those who did not take the FSA writing test last Thursday, makeups are today. Please check your school Gmail or check in with your English teacher on your testing location. Now on to Sam with National Sports. What's up, Warriors? My name's Sam here with National Sports News. This past weekend at the 2022 Masters at Augusta National, it wrapped up and it was quite the historic tournament. World number one, Scotty Scheffler, won his first career major win and became the fifth golfer to enter Augusta National ranked number one and win the Masters. Scheffler finished the tournament 10 under par, three strokes ahead of second place winner Rory McIlroy. Also at this year's tournament, Hall of Famer Tiger Woods made his big comeback in an attempt to win his 16th major championship and sixth green jacket. Just 14 months after nearly losing his right leg in a car accident, though not his best weekend, Tiger was impressive and amazing to watch. That's all for today, Warriors. Thanks for watching. Now here's Kaylee with the weather. Hey, I'm Kaylee with your daily weather. Today's weather is a high of 86 and a low of 61. Next up, we have Nick and Will with Pop Culture. Thanks for tuning in to Wild TV. Have a terrific Tuesday, and we will see you tomorrow.